going on? It's your girl Fathom DJ here with another Sunday's Truth. I have a confession. I'm not popular. <laughs> Maybe this isn't a new memo for you. <laughs> Uh, it reminds me of being in high school and not really grammar school because, you you know, I don't know who's paying attention to being popular or not in grammar school. I'm a nerd uh, for all practical purposes. I'm shy. I'm an introvert. I'm, um, I, I can be outspoken, but I also can be very quiet and pensive. Um, and coming back into my Danielle Abstin account, um, slash Fathom DJ Facebook account has really opened my eyes to the fact that people are doing a lot of things to be liked. The children come to mind because it really makes you understand the concept of trend and the necessary, uh, the necessity to strengthen um, individuality. Um, what I'm seeing at this point is tons of people doing and saying things because they want to be liked or popular or seen or famous. And that just, it, 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 it's weird to me. Um, especially because, you know, we are supposed to be in a space of liking who we like, um, especially in our adult lives. And it seems to me that, um, we're, kind of growing down instead of growing up in terms of what we are doing in order to become popular. Oh, if I post this photo with me in these shoes or if I post this photo with myself completely beat out, I'm going to get tons of likes. If I post myself on an average day sitting at the park, kicking it with no makeup, no cleavage or any of those things, that photo is just going to be seen as nothing. So which photo are you going to continue to post? Which um, action or which uh, reaction are you going to continue to have to things? It's a longer conversation. But the idea for me at this point is to remind those who are interested in individuality to be yourself, um, especially as it pertains to the children, to the babies to feel who you are, try to stay in tune with your heart and your spirit and your mind so that you stay in line with your individuality because a lot of folks ain't thinking, they're just doing based on what they see being done. That is trend. Um, it's interesting, the Beyonce conversation came up the other day with a comrade of, of mine and I, and we were discussing her and her play in um, the formation thing. And it's very trendy to talk about race. It's very trendy to jump on the racism bandwagon. And it's not to suggest that racism hasn't always been a problem, but it has these peaks where everybody's all about it. And when they don't see the racist acts or they don't see the atrocities against particular individuals, race, or sex, then they don't talk about it and they're not doing anything about it. And I don't like that. I don't like trend. Um, vinyl is another just throw to the wind. Everybody's running out and buying vinyl. And when the trend ends, what happens to you in that? Do you just go and sell all the vinyl that you had and sell those turntables that you bought after you invested so much and you just don't use them anymore? They just, they just fall it's something about that. You know, when people are no longer popular, then they become has-beens and what kind of energy that might put a person in if they're, you know, falling from grace. Um, what kind of energy might that project for a child who had a good day at school and everybody liked them and then the day after that nobody pays them attention. It's a real play on psychology and it really can, if you're not strong enough, it really can, um, it really can eat at you and your spirit. So Sunday's truth is to reinvigor those who are individuals to believe in themselves, believe in yourself, believe 
um, and your heart and spirit being aligned and doing the right thing and, and moving from a place of, of intuition over popularity and trend, you know, old school, you know, your mother used to say, if everybody jumps off a bridge, are you going to jump? There's the question. If everybody posts photos of themselves half nude, are you going to do that too? Are you going to post photos of yourself um, doing whatever you're doing that could be um, popular but against your better judgment? I shouldn't have done that. You might regret it. So that's it for me today. Today, Sunday's truth is be yourself. Be who you are. Stand strong in your convictions. Stand strong in your belief of who you are and understanding that regardless of the fact that you may not have a trillion friends or a trillion likes, the idea that you're valid in the world because you are here is important for those who um, who want to continue to do what they do for themselves and because they like it, not because everybody else enjoys it. Um, that's it for me. Anyway, Fathom DJ, Sunday's Truth. Uh, cosmic kisses and well wishes to your day and yeah that's it holla at your girl space